All right, so a lot of customers uh, ask us this because uh, whenever you have a Mitsubishi system, by default, it will come, uh, depending on the unit, it will come with the function of running the fan constantly, even though the heating and or cooling will be satisfied. And that's actually a preferred mode. You always want to circulate air. Uh, you always want to filter the air. But however, some customers don't want that or don't like that. So one way to do it is to go into the thermostat or remote controller settings and go through some function codes. And it's a little bit complicated. It's got numbers and you have to know how to get into it. But the other way is that if you have a Kumo cloud on the particular unit installed, all you have to do is press the settings down there in the lower right, um, go into system setup, go into installer settings, and then pick the zone you want to deal with. Right, and then you will have this word on the in, the in the red called advanced, and under advanced there is a category that is called thermo off fan. I'm moving it to the very top right there. Thermo off fan. You go in here, and now you have your choices: extra low in heat, which is um, my preferred method for whenever we install these units. Is that I like the heat to be even. So you want the systems running in a very, very low fan speed, uh, even though the heat has been satisfied. It would just even out the air. But of course, you can stop it in heat mode. You could stop it in cool and heat mode, or you can stop it just in cool mode, or you can stop it in cool mode and have that extra low in heat, which is another way to do it. Or if you want to have the fan circulating, you put selectable in cool and heat. Now, selectable uh, in cool and heat, which basically means whatever you set it to on your remote control or your thermostat, that'll be the fan speed. So if you have it on high and the system is satisfied, it's done heating or done cooling, it will continue to blow on high uh, fan speed. And of course, if you go up to the thermostat, you change it to low to medium, that's exactly what it will be. So this is a nice, easy way to uh, change that setting without having to go into the field uh, installer menus on the thermostat, which are a little bit more complicated to navigate.